In a world where most vehicles blend into a sea of sameness, the Tesla Cybertruck bursts onto the scene like a neon-painted spaceship landing at a beige parking lot. With its sharp angles and futuristic design, it's not just a truck, it's a bold statement on wheels. People either love it or hate it, but no one can ignore it. And the best part? It's not just a pretty face, it's packed with groundbreaking features that make it as functional as it is fascinating. But there's more to this beast than meets the eye. Ready to find out why the Cybertruck is the future of vehicles? Let's dive into the genius behind Tesla's most audacious creation yet. The Tesla Cybertruck's design philosophy hinges on its undeniable individuality. In a world where originality is scarce, the Cybertruck stands out boldly and is not just breaking the mold, it's smashing it to pieces with a sledgehammer. Most vehicles today look somewhat similar to the constraints of design. They all need wheels, doors, windshields, and bumpers. However, the Cybertruck breaks this mold. Remarkably, it features no Tesla branding on its exterior, yet everyone recognizes it as a Tesla. This is a testament to its iconic design. Even those who can't distinguish a Toyota Camry from a Kia Forte know a Cybertruck when they see one. Some individuals may argue that intentionally designing something that can be perceived as brutally ugly does not equate to iconic design. However, it prompts the question, do we truly desire our cars to possess conventional beauty? Especially in the context of a pickup truck, which isn't a piece of art meant to be showcased in a glass case. It's a practical vehicle meant to withstand the elements and daily wear and tear. It's exposed to rain, snow, bird droppings, and the inevitable bumps and scratches from everyday use. Eventually, it depreciates in value and is traded in for a fraction of its original price. But the Cybertruck isn't just about striking looks. For example, the four-wheel, steer-by-wire system implemented on the Cybertruck is by far the most insane technological level-up ever done in the automotive industry, period. We've seen four-wheel steering in limited applications, and we've seen steer-by-wire in even more limited applications, but the Cybertruck is the first time we've ever seen what happens when you drop both systems into one vehicle that stood to benefit the most from them and to do it better than anyone else has done before. Lexus was the first automaker to try and introduce steer-by-wire as a new innovation with their RZ450 crossover vehicle prototypes in 2022. Tesla, on the other hand, was the first automaker to introduce a yoke-style steering wheel with their Model S Plaid in 2021. General Motors fared a little better with their implementation of four-wheel steering on the 2022 electric Hummer, which gave the massive vehicle an uncanny level of agility. This is where the Cybertruck swoops in and takes three half-baked ideas and combines them into one system that just makes sense. Here's how the Cybertruck's steering system operates. Each wheel is linked to a steering rack, with separate ones for the front and rear wheels. Instead of relying on traditional mechanical steering column and pinion system, these racks are powered by electric motors. Inside the Cybertruck, steering input is transmitted through a unique combination of a steering yoke and a wheel which Tesla refers to as a squirkle, a blend of a square and circle, reminiscent of squirtle with a C. Thanks to steer-by-wire technology, the squirkle doesn't require rotation like a traditional wheel and moves up to 180 degrees in either direction. The yoke design aligns seamlessly with steer-by-wire functionality, and Tesla opted to compromise by incorporating elements of a wheel to create that squirkle for the Cybertruck. At low speeds, a small amount of input from the driver translates into a relatively large amount of movement on the steering rack. At high speeds, a large amount of input from the driver translates into a relatively low amount of movement on the steering rack. This effectively shrinks the wheelbase of the truck and tightens up the turning circle, allowing the Cybertruck to turn a tighter circle than the Model S. This essentially eliminates the biggest downside to pickup truck ownership. The only thing the Cybertruck doesn't do is crank the rear wheels fully in the same direction as the front wheels at low speed, which would result in a diagonal crab movement, a special feature on the Hummer EV. In theory, this is something Tesla could easily add in software, but they probably don't see it as much real-world use for it. At speeds above 40 miles per hour, the rear wheels turn a very slight degree in the same direction as the front wheels, which helps to smooth out steering performance during slight maneuvers like lane changes. This is already a significantly more advanced approach than what Lexus has been testing in their new crossover platform. 
The biggest complaint about the Lexus steer-by-wire system was that they tried to maintain a linear steering profile, like with a mechanical system, but with the same reduction in steering input. So no matter what speed you are traveling in the Lexus, a small amount of steering input would turn the car a little, and a large amount of steering input would turn the car a lot making slight movements at high speed, like a lane change, into very fine balance between the right amount of steering input and way too much. The Cybertruck's unconventional approach extends to its marketing strategy, which is nothing short of genius. Elon Musk didn't set out to design the perfect pickup truck, instead he aimed to disrupt the automotive industry and stir up controversy. And it worked. The Cybertruck's polarizing design and bold features generates endless discussion both positive and negative which only fuels its notoriety. Musk's strategy taps into a unique aspect of human nature, our love for outrage. In the age of social media, nothing grabs attention like controversy. People love to argue, critique, and complain. And Musk capitalized on this brilliantly. The more people talk about the Cybertruck, whether they're praising its innovations or mocking its quirks, the more famous it becomes. This principle is also applied when Musk rebranded Twitter to X, sparking widespread debate and keeping the platform in the spotlight. Now, Elon changing the name from Twitter to X was done with the intention of provoking people, and it succeeded. Similarly, when individuals criticize the Cybertruck, whether it's about its battery life, performance in snow, durability, or rusting issues, they inadvertently contribute to its fame. Ultimately, every critique of the Cybertruck be it about its battery life, performance in snow, or rapid rusting, only serves to make it more infamous. In the world of business, any publicity is good publicity, and the Cybertruck epitomizes this adage. It's a vehicle designed not just to transport, but to challenge conventions and provoke reactions, ensuring it remains a topic of conversation for years to come. The Tesla Cybertruck has often been criticized for its unconventional appearance, described as ugly, ineffective, inefficient, impractical, unsafe, overpriced, and poorly made, resembling a rusty refrigerator on wheels. However, there's another side to the story that highlights the genius behind its design. What sets the Cybertruck apart is its unmistakable individuality. In an era where original ideas are scarce, the Cybertruck stands out as a truly unique creation. This design philosophy behind the Cybertruck aims to disrupt the cycle. It doesn't pretend to be anything other than a sturdy metal box on wheels. It doesn't rely on fancy paint jobs to hide imperfections. Instead, it embraces its raw appearance. It challenges people to put it to the test, daring them to inflict damage. And it takes the hits like a champ. If it gets a bit rusty over time, that's just part of its charm. A quick sanding and buffing can restore its appearance. Even if Joe Rogan were to take aim at it with an arrow, it's all about the patina and personality. I think it adds to the Cybertruck cool factor. And that wraps up our deep dive into the Tesla Cybertruck. From its polarizing design to its groundbreaking technology, it's clear this vehicle isn't just a pickup, it's a statement. What do you think about its futuristic features? Are you ready to ride the wave of innovation? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. If you've enjoyed this journey through automotive innovation, don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe for more content, and ring that notification bell to stay updated. Thanks for watching, and until next time, keep driving towards the future.